Okay, congratulations, you guys. You guys were very funny in this movie. Okay. And and first of all, Charlie, I just want to start with you because first big feature film. Sure. Did yeah. he show you the ropes here? You know, Mr. Veteran? He, yeah, gave me a lot of notes and a lot of like, say your line like this and say your line like that. And I would try and keep up with him, but I couldn't understand a lick of anything you were saying. Was that your impression of me? Uh, hey, Charlie, try, try. I don't, I, don't, I don't talk like that. You're not an old cowboy from the... That's oh, you're Sudeikis. That's not how I talk. That's not how I talk. I forgot which guy. I thought you were, you were Sam Elliott. Elliot. Sam Elliott did a cameo. You, you what cut you out. need to do is you need to understand. You need to talk like this. Yeah. Uh, no, I was super excited to be part of the cast and um, and uh, a big fan of this guy. And it was just great to work with him. So when you have two funny guys like you, um, how much improvisation is going on here? There's quite a bit. I wouldn't say... Well, I mean, 50-50, uh, you know, like... Uh, the, there was the a lot of funny stuff on the page, and, and we used some of that, and they gave us liberty to come up with some funny stuff on our own, so... Yeah. Uh, stuff, you know, writing in, in the moment, in the day, uh, like, you know, um, you know, sort of during, uh, you do numerous takes, and you just want to change it for each other and keep it fresh, and, you know, just little, little variations here and there. And I understand from uh, Nanette, the uh, director, you had to justify your mustache. I did. I did. Do you want to tell us why? I had uh, uh, done, started another movie earlier in the summer where I had a mustache, and then there were a few days crossover, and and uh, there was uh, there was talk that uh, maybe the, the going the distance wasn't going to work out because they didn't they needed me to come in and see the uh, see what I looked like with this mustache, and so I came in and and then I, I talked about it, and I was like, well, I, f I forgot at that point what my character did for a living, and she was like, oh, you work at a record label. I was like, well, then I can absolutely have a mustache if I was. You know, an assistant coach at you know for a Bobby Knight basketball team or in the military, I couldn't have it. But you know, come on, I'm at a, a Brooklyn <laughs> record label. I should be all right with this. And uh, and then yeah, then we had the we wrote that scene the day of um, where where the justification came about. And then you all followed suit and had one you know for later yeah. on in the film too. Not bad. That's no. right. Yeah, Not that's bad. right. That was my real mustache, and it was pretty scary leaving work that day. Yeah. You know. I would imagine. It's it was. Inappropriate. Inappropriate. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just leave it at that for sure. Now, the this very interesting topic about long distance relationships. Have I, have either of you had, you know, gone through long distance relationships before? Yeah. Yeah. We both have. Mm -hmm. Yeah. With each other. Yeah. <laughs> um, and we're working on it. We're yeah. Working on it. That's you know, it's more of a friend, a long, a long distance friendship, which right. I guess it wasn't what you were asking about. But um, uh, I have not got, had one in a long time, because they stink. Yeah, I had one that for a, for a while that uh, we'd 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 be apart. We'd come back together. We'd be apart. We'd come back together, and then eventually, when we were, when we were together for uh, longer than two years, then then we then we then we separated. Well, so then there you go. So the long distance thing actually worked better uh, in your favor. To a degree, yeah. I mean, there were, there were parts that that were good, and then there were parts that were bad. Well, but, of course. Uh, yeah. 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 <laughs> See, for me, I yeah, I had long distance for a while, and then I said this is no good, and I traveled the distance, and and mm -hmm. I married the girl. Wow, so, boy. Well, romantic. Go. Very romantic. Yeah. That's very good story. Now, working with uh, someone like Justin Long, I, I mean, you guys, the three of you worked very well together. Was it an instant bonding with you guys, the three of you? I felt so. Well, you knew yeah, Justin. Yeah, I've actually known Justin for, for years from a, a theater festival where we worked together. Um, like Did you guys work work together? Um, no, actually, we weren't in the same show, but right. we were just buddies. <coughs> and then I would see him out and about. Um, so I was just so excited to work with him because uh, I knew we shared a sense of humor. And uh, but well, yeah, we clicked. We clicked quick. It was nice. After the we had like rehearsals after the table read when you came out there. Forget what we did, camera testing right, and yeah. stuff. We all went for a out for a beer at <coughs> afterwards at this place called the Coffee Shop in Union Square. Mm -hmm. um, and and yeah, you could sort of tell after that 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 was the first time we we really hung out. Justin and I had met once or twice before, but always got along with him very well. And you could sort of t I was like, oh, this well, we're just already friends, so. As long as they uh, light this correctly, this should actually work out. Yeah. So yeah, <laughs> we, we kind of got together and we hit it off, and then you know the helicopter came down and picked Justin up and yeah. he flew off, and we're like, man, he's just like us. He is. He's just one he's of us. Just like us. So we go. <laughs> just iPods falling out of his pants. iPods. Yeah. Yeah. And Max. IPods. Yeah. It's just and Max. Yeah, yeah. It's great. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> now uh, I have to ask you about um, bathroom etiquette. The scene when you're sure. sitting on the toilet with the door open. Not good. Not good. Uncomfortable? The scene's not good? No, I'm saying just, just, no, the scene was funny, okay. but uh, not something I, you know, would want to watch all the time. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm, was that uncomfortable for you? No, because I'm very proud of the side of my thighs, yeah. and I, great I want them to work a ton, you yeah. know, and yeah. I cover them up so much in life 
Um, uh, that scene was a lot of fun to do. That was that was one of the ones that uh, you know we tried a bunch of different ways and tried a bunch of different things, and I think. Uh, ultimately decided it'd be pretty funny to have a very serious sort of intimate conversation whilst on the toilet and yeah. work, working some door gags.